That's right, Willowers. Welcome to the Willow Weekly. This week, we are not in location at the world's famous green room, but in this beautiful rock garden. Hey, who's that down there? I don't know. Excuse me, what's your name? Hi there. My name is Miss Emily, and you've maybe seen me around the halls and Willow. I'm here because I'm a sign language interpreter, and I work with a student who needs to use sign language. Nice to see you. <laughs> Wow, Josie, doesn't it feel good to be outside in this beautiful Colorado weather? Speaking of weather, our favorite weatherman from CBS4, Dave Aguilera, came to teach our second graders about this crazy Colorado weather. Hey, here, for a storm to be called a hurricane, the winds in that hurricane have to go 74 miles an hour or higher. We would be barely, barely able to stand in that. Your hair would be blown all around and everything. So, so 74 miles an hour. So this is a weather balloon. So when it's filled up, it stretches out. And it's about as tall as me when it's filled up. You tell up. me when you see the tornado. I do. see it. Now, if you look real close, can you see it? a little spin going on in there? So it's, it's coming in on all four sides like in a thunderstorm, creating a vortex. And he killed the tornado! It's Titus the Tornado Killer, everybody! Give him a big round of Can you see that? Can you see where it's changed to a gel? And on the other side, it's changed to a powder on that one side there. Can you see that? And it's still soaking it up. Sitting down if you're on the floor. Okay, here we go. Ready? What's it feel like? Because it's plastic, it's not like water. All the water is inside those little grains, so it you know what's great about the newscast? What? When a kid hands in a script 100 percent prepared to give a perfect performance. Just like these two segments. Willow Elementary. Every day it's time to make a perfect day. Respect your teachers, be so kind, and make sure your day is very new. Make our days happy days, it's the day we have to say. It's time for Willow Elementary. It's a happy day where we all get to spend time together. When we're all here, always here together. Uh, the sun is up, we are running around. We're playing with our friends, with all us around. School is important because it helps students learn and achieve goals. School is also important because if there is no school, teachers couldn't teach so we wouldn't know how to do math, read, or write. School is also important because that's where you meet your best friends, like these two. Hi people! School is important! Our new games at recess seem to be a big hit. One of the most popular games is a basketball competition game called Knockout. Let's see how the pros play it. And I would like to say that I'm glad I had a worthy opponent because this cat has got some shit. When the news kids need to find a segment, the easiest way is to wander on over to second and first grade PBL and ask the kids what they're up to. I'm making pizza for this blue llama and he wants cheese, pepperoni, and pineapple on it. And at the end, okay, he pays me and I have to figure out how much change to give him. Today in PBL, we are making tin for your sailboat. Come sail away, come sail away with me. Well, they're learning how to sail away. We're learning over here to write in cursive. Well, they're trying to sail away and, and, and write in cursive. I'm over here drawing a masterpiece. 
Sometimes the creativity and accuracy of the projects are second, second to none. Hey, Mr. Taff, I made you a golf course. Here's the water that you always hit into. Here's the sand trap that you always hit into. Here's the out of balance that you always hit into. Here's the green that you never hit into. Talk about a mega power video. We have two of the WE stars in one segment. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. In one corner, we have the Kansas City King. And in the other corner, the ECE Veggie Master, Ms. Smith. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Let's see what the mega powers have to say. Hey, good morning, Ms. Schmidt. What are you wearing? That's my favorite stuff. <laughs> and why are you late? Uh, it just took a while to get ready this morning, Mr. Lezzo. And that shirt does not match dress code. Sorry, sorry about that. Hey, Willow Hawks. Uh, I just wanted to announce that in the month of October, we're going to have a uniform contest. So every day that your class is 100% in uniform, you'll get a point. And at the end of the month, we'll calculate the winner, and the winner will get a top secret prize. Here's a reminder, Hawks. These are a few things that are not in uniform. No hat. No big logos. No tutu. Come on. No jeans. That's a wrap, Willowers, from the great outdoors of Willow Elementary. That's a wrap. <laughs> That's a wrap. <laughs> Here's a reminder. Nope. What? Nope. <laughs> Speaking of weather, our favorite, uh, nah.